Have you heard of the sugar diet? The one people say helps you burn fat, boost metabolism, and get shredded fast. Sounds too good to be true, right? It's going viral right now. Bodybuilders loading on sugar like it's a performance enhancer. Sugar for breakfast, sugar during workout, sugar all day long. Natural and processed. They say if you eat a ton of sugar but cut out fat, you'll burn more calories and lose fat faster. Here's the truth. Rapid weight loss doesn't always mean you're doing great. It often means your body is entering an emergency state, a survival response. Stress hormones spike. Essential systems start shutting down to conserve energy. You burn through muscle. You drop water and lean mass. Yes, your body may also tap into fat stores. Not because it's optimized, but because it's desperately trying to survive without proper fuel. Fat is essential for health, for hormones, for brain function, for cell repair. So when your body starts stripping it away aggressively, that's not a sign of success. It's a sign of distress. And what's driving the so-called metabolic boost? A hormone called FGF21. Yes, sugar triggers it, but FGF21 isn't some fat-burning miracle. It's a metabolic distress signal, commonly seen in unhealthy, overweight people. Your body turns it on when things are going wrong, not when things are doing great. Let's be real. Eating mostly sugary and starchy carbs and ultra-processed foods means replacing essential nutrients with glucose, fructose, and tons of inflammatory stuff. And in case of these bodybuilders, most of their calories come from ultra-processed foods. And we know the consequences of this type of eating. The sugar diet sounds like every sugar addict's dream. Eating junk food, tons of sugar, and losing weight. But that's not how it works. What's wrong with the sugar diet? There's no protein to build or repair muscle. No fats to support brain or hormones. No micronutrients. No fiber. No balance. Eating too much sugar causes blood sugar spikes and crashes. Tons of glycation, where sugar damages cells, tissues, and organs, causing inflammation and faster aging. Lack of essential nutrients, leaving you malnourished. Every chemical reaction inside your body requires nutrients. You don't need just energy. You need nutrients from real foods. On this sugar diet, you're not just losing weight. You're losing your health. Here's an interesting fact. Your body needs just one teaspoon of glucose in your body at any given time. That's about four grams. That's it. Now, compare that to a high-carb, high-sugar diet. 200, 300, or even 700 grams of carbs a day, mostly from sugar. Knowing that glucose is non-essential and your body can make what it needs without you eating carbs at all, this doesn't make any sense. That's not fuel. That's a metabolic overload. Your body doesn't need that much sugar. It doesn't even have a good place to store it. We can store fat efficiently, but not glucose. We can store only a small amount. So where does the excess glucose go in your body? Into your fat cells, into your liver, into your arteries, into your brain, causing inflammation and damage. And when you overload your body with sugary and starchy carbs day after day, you flood your system with glucose, more than your cells can handle. So your body responds with a surge of insulin, trying to push all that sugar out of your blood into storage and your cells. If it would release all of it at once, you would be in a serious trouble. It's deadly. Do it often enough. Overload your system with glucose and your cells will stop listening. That's insulin resistance. Most people eat more carbs than their bodies need. And most people are insulin resistant. It doesn't start with diabetes. It starts with chronically elevated insulin. The high-carb, high-sugar diet leads to this every single day. 
too much glucose and insulin flooding your body. And from there, the damage spreads. High carb, high sugar diets lead to glucose toxicity, where your tissues get overloaded and start breaking down. Glycation, sugar binds to proteins and literally ages your cells. Chronic inflammation, the root of nearly every major disease. Fatty liver, too much sugar turns into fat in your liver. Type 2 diabetes, heart disease and stroke. This isn't just about fat loss. It's not even just about blood sugar. This is a full body metabolic breakdown driven by too much sugar too often and ignoring the true needs of your body. What works for some bodybuilders may not work for real people, especially if you're overweight and sedentary, like most people. Even the bodybuilders loading up on these enormous amounts of carbs daily, they're totally clueless and careless about their health. Should you take any health advice from these people? I wouldn't. Before trying any diet for quick weight loss, ask yourself, is this sustainable? Can you eat this way for the rest of your life? In the case of the sugar diet, can you eat tons of sugar, fruit, fruit juice, extremely low amounts of protein and fat for the rest of your life? Because if the answer is no, I can guarantee you'll regain the weight. 99% of people fail with weight loss and regain it back because they chase unsustainable quick fixes instead of creating healthy long-term eating habits. If it's not a lifestyle, it's a trap. Real results come from blood sugar control, addressing insulin resistance, having enough protein, fat, and fiber, having stable energy throughout the day, eating natural whole foods that nourish your body. The sugar diet isn't a breakthrough. It's just the newest way to destroy your metabolism. It can help you lose weight fast and regain it back. Stop the fads. What you need is a sustainable approach that focuses on eating natural whole foods.